Well, good morning. I'm Paul Begley. Late breaking news. Pensacola Beach, which is quite large, of course, if you go along the coast of Florida, but right near the Alabama line of the Pensacola shoreline there, the Pensacola Beach, right near the Alabama line, a quarter of a mile of the beach this morning has been shut down has been literally closed. It is shut down. And the reason they've closed that part of the Pensacola Beach is because overnight, huge, I'm talking huge blob of oil washed ashore. So large that literally, and we're not talking about, you know, what was happening yesterday uh, at, over in the other parts of the real nice areas, the Pensacola Beach where, you know, with these blobs as big as this right here, you know, and, and, and Little World Ones and just all kinds of these blobs and turning this real, 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 real dark red blobby colors, blackish looking oil blobs that washed ashore on the Pensacola beaches and just marred up the beautiful white sands and have broken the hearts. And, and if you got to know if you're a restaurant owner or hotel, uh, rest, uh, resort areas, uh, that you know, gift shops, everybody up and down the sandals, you know, if you're selling sandals and 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 sunglasses and everything else that's going on, this is horrible news, because now people are not going, they're not going to go, you know. And I know, just seven days ago, President Barack Obama was there, visiting the Gulf with Haley Barber and and Governor Crisp and Bobby Jindal and and uh, the president even went and played golf and ate a snow cone and was, everybody was happy. But you see, the real issue here is there's 3 million gallons a day pouring into the Gulf of Mexico. And these plumes are so gigantic that, are, that you can't see. We see the oil on the top of the surface, and we got these skimmer boats out there, and we're burning oil, and, and we got people standing on the sand waiting for just a little of it trickling up. What has been happening in Pensacola is just the barely scratching the surface. It's, a, it's just the trickle. This morning you got a, you got a little dose of some of the real stuff, blob blobs that were so huge, gigantic, that come ashore, gooey and saturating and ruining. And so it's going to continue. The 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 thing is, this is day 67. You think it thing any better? I mean, it's gushing right now. And so seriously, the Pensacola Beach is in a world of trouble. They've shut it down. Part of Pensacola Beach has been shut down. I'm Paul Begley reporting.